guys, what up, and welcome back to yet another demo of one of my favorite half wakes. This one is called Curvy Addiction, and it is from Utre. It is a Converti Cap Wager. Not quite sure how long it is, because, um, you know, as usual, they don't say. But uh, one of the reasons why I really like this is the fact that it doesn't really get tangled, but also it has the Converti Cap drawstring, and it not only has a comb on the top and the bottom, but it also has combs on the side, which make a world of difference. Now, because um, the texture on this wig is a little bit different than the other one, it's a lot straighter and um, a little bit more shiny, I would say. I'm usually going for a very uh, straight, bone straight, shiny look on this wig, which unfortunately means that I have to use higher heat. I usually don't like to do that, but for this wig, I have to do it. And that means going in smaller sections, which I also don't like to do, because your girl is lazy and she really don't want to sit there for 15 to 20 minutes straightening the hell out of some hair, but we do anyway. And she's straight, and she's cute, and she's shiny. Um, yeah. So now that that is done, let me show you how I put it on. I just brush it out with the paddle brush to make it smooth, you know, a little bit shiny. Um, I'm going to show you, of course, my little bun that I use instead of a cap. Um, and I'll show you just now the string that you can use to make the um, wig as tight or as loose as you want it. And then, as usual, I just swing it back. This time, I pull my hair forward. And yes, I know my hair is uneven, but in a second, it won't matter. Pull it forward, stick the comb in at the top, and then I stick the combs on the side in individually, and we go. Alright guys, and here is the almost final product. Um, I could definitely leave it like this. Uh, it's gorgeous. Um, but I'm actually going to take my little paddle brush here. Well, not little. And then I'm going to brush the front here back into the wig. Just so that it covers the top. And then I'm just going to blend my hair into it, just like that. And ta-da! So I like to wear this wig when I want to feel expensive. Um, but as per usual, you know, because my hair uh, tends to get very frizzy. Um, it's a crapshoot. So as I said, it's really long. It comes to, I want to say, just above the tips of my titties. Um, what's that white stuff? Anyway, so yeah, it comes to like just about the tips of my titties. Um, and she cute. She real cute. This is what she looks like uh, from the side. You can see. Both sides um, and the front, like you can literally style this any way you want to. Like, you could do um, all kinds of parts everywhere. She's just really, really cute and still very casual. So, yeah, and look, my hair's already starting to frizz up. I hate it here. The AC is on. I thought that you know I could maybe not get frizzy for once, but apparently not. Um, but yeah, this is. Where's the phone? Got it. I got it. Um, on Sam's Beauty, and I'll put the link in the description bar below. I did put the link for the other one in the description bar. I just forgot to tell you guys about it. Um, this is available from Sam's Beauty for... It is $30.99, $30 but as usual, it is on sale, and it is on sale right now for $17.99. Um, 
the color that I got is one because once again my hair is jet black regardless of what it looks like when it is not flat ironed. When it's not flat ironed it looks more like 1B um, but once it's straightened it is definitely a one. Um, you know and I kind of like this one because it kind of looks like my hair did when I lived in Jersey and I'll throw a picture of my hair up here when it was super long when I lived in Jersey so this one really the texture it's a little bit more shiny than my hair but the texture is almost spot on um, <clears throat> for what my hair used to look like so the converted cap has a drawstring which is why I really like those because I was finding that the regular half wigs were a little bit too big for my big ass head like I was very surprised by that and uh, they weren't secure because the couple that I had gotten from the at the start of my wig journey didn't have enough combs um, and as you guys see I don't wear a wig cap so I kind of sort of do need a comb for it to like stay where it's supposed to stay um, so the converti uh, the converti cap uh, is very uh, secure because I can pull the drawstring as tight as I want to and also I've found that the um, the lining of the converti caps is not quite as thick so my scalp can actually breathe a little bit more which is always a great thing because you guys know I sweat from my head like yo my head is heating up right now you y'all don't even understand what <laughs> y'all don't even get it but anyway guys this is um Curvy Addiction from Outre. It is a converted cap half wig. You can style it any way you want to. You can get it at Sam's Club for $17.99. Tell me what you think. It comes in, I don't even remember how many colors it comes in. It comes in 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 shades, 10 colors. It is called, it is a natural yaki. It is also synthetic. Um... And the shade that I got, it says for length, it says long, okay? We can see that. Uh, and the shade I got, once again, is one, and this is what she looks like. All right, guys, tell me what you think about this wig um, in the comment section. Ask any questions, because I'm probably sure I forgot something. And, as usual, it's been real, it's been fun, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.